Hello, kindergarten. Welcome to math. We are going to do our clocks time by the hour for April 28th. And I have a very special math assistant with me today. Come and say hello, math assistant. No, it is not a cat. It is indeed a human. Hi, guys. <laughs> so we are looking at our nine o'clock hour today. All right. And I'm excited. Lynn, do you remember when you did these as kindergarten? Yep. And these were fun, weren't they? Yep. Yep. So I'm going to tilt you down and kind of turn this way. So Lynn, you're going to have to do this kind of upside down okay. and with a Sharpie. So if we're looking at the nine o'clock, where or what, let's review this. What kind of clock is this? Analog. It's clock. an analog clock. What kind of clock is this? Analog clock. Good. What kind of clock is this? Digital clock. What is the difference between a digital and an analog clock? A analog clock has hands and a digital clock does not. What does the digital clock have? It has only... It has... Um, what are these? Numbers. Numbers. Good. And what are these two dots called? It's the same name as one of our organs, actually. It's a colon. Okay. okay. All right. So, how are you going to draw the hour of nine o'clock? Oh, are we only going halfway? <laughs> okay, and there's the hour hand. Okay, and the minute hand goes all the way to the 12. Good. Okay, and then how are we going to draw it on a watch? And remember to only go halfway for the hour hand. So is this too long? Yes, and that's okay, because what you can do then is just draw it in a different color. The hour hand needs to be much smaller than the minute hand, okay? All right, I'm gonna turn this around so Lynn can write her nines upside down. I mean, right side up. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna put that hour is right there and our minutes right there okay and then you guys can go back later and rainbow write our time in numbers and our time in words okay and let's take a look at our maze okay you're not going to need the marker anymore and let's get boom a pretty dark color okay that one's good too Let's find the start clock where it says start. And let's find the finish. The finish is down here. Oh, it's off camera, so let's scooch. There we go. Okay, it's now, kind of too light. do you remember? Oh, should we get a darker one? Let's get a darker blue. There we go. Now, remember, I encourage you guys to a line through or an X through your clock as you go through the maze. You cannot go diagonally. You can only go left to right or up and down. Okay. And take the time to, oh, that's diagonal. You cannot go diagonal. Where's the next nine o'clock from here? Where are you? Right there. No, oh, well, technically you're right here. Where's the next nine o'clock? Look all around. Oh, wait, you went down and up? No, so, I went there. I went. Oh, there. that's a, what time does this clock say? That one says three o'clock. Okay, so that's okay. 
So what you can do is go in with a different color and put an X to remind you to not color that one in later. Okay, there is your nine o'clock. And you're at a weird angle. So where's, you want me to turn this around? No, you're okay? Okay. Okay, good. Finish. So once, now when you go back through, don't color the one that you X'd off, okay? You guys can go back and color that in later, okay? All right, now on this one, we're mixing up the times. So we need a yellow. If the clock says seven o'clock, you're gonna color it yellow. If the clock says eight o'clock, you are going to color it brown. You're gonna color it brown and nine o'clock is purple. Mom's favorite color. Woohoo! All right. So what time does this clock say? Nine o'clock. So we're gonna color it. Okay, purple. Good. What time does this clock say? Eight o'clock. So we're gonna color it. What color? Brown. Brown. And what time does this one say? Seven o'clock. So we're gonna color it. Yellow. Oh, excuse me. Oh, we went to my podiatrist today, this morning, and they're doing a lot of construction. It was picking up dust today. Whew. All right. Nine o'clock. Nine o'clock. So it's going to be what color? Purple. Yep. Hey, that's kind of like a pattern. A little here. bit. Then they're going to mix it up. Okay. And then Seven you guys can finish the rest of these later. Okay. I love coloring. Okay. So that's great practice. And remember what hint I gave you the other day that you've got the first number on a digital clock is the hour. Okay. What time is it right now? 11 o'clock. 11 o'clock. Okay. But in a few minutes, it'll, the zero will change to a zero one and then a zero two. And that's how many minutes into the 11 o'clock hour you happen to be. And yes, that is a four month old baby Lynn. Angel. Not much has changed, especially in those eyes. And yes, I have a big crack on my phone. <laughs> that's why you have a screen protector. So you guys can go up to, don't touch your parents phone without permission, right? But there are usually digital clocks. Oh, there it is. Now we are one minute into the 11 o'clock hour. Okay, but you can go up to, there's usually digital clocks on microwaves and ovens or stovetops. And you can go up there and say, hey, mom, dad, it's 11 and whatever this number is. Oh, one. So it's 1101 oh, or it's 11. There's a two and a six, 11, 26. And you have just read the time. Huh, okay, so you guys can do it, hey, all right? Mom, it's 11, oh, it's 11, oh, one. one. It's 11, oh, one. Yes, ma'am, all right, so you can do it. All right. Have a wonderful rest we of your day and we'll see you next time. Remember to hit the subscribe button. Yeah. <laughs> and the notification bell. Yep. <laughs> Y'all later. Bye.